Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Dr. PGNGM. Praise God, he get money. Back for another YouTube video. Banger, man. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Y'all know what time it is. The doctor's in the house. So check this out, man. Dr. Boxer, I appreciate you tapping in with me. Um, yeah, you should see I'm already sitting down. I'm outside with it, you know. Um, I was, uh... I wanted to sit down, start this video sitting down because it, it, it's, it's, a, it's a sad day in boxing, you know what I'm saying? And I'm not saying that it's a sad day, let me be very clear, it's not a sad day because of I like a certain boxer or I dislike a certain boxer. It's a sad day because once again, the sport has been significantly tarnished. Another uh, stain has been placed on the sport, you know what I'm saying, as far as an integrity standpoint, as far as a, a honest standpoint, and, 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 and as far as, a, um, you know, it's another reason to have, to, to, que to question the trust. You know, from 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 the participants to the to to the to the governing bodies to the from a fan standpoint, you know what I'm saying? It's like a lot of people have been exposed, you know, in, in addition to Ryan Garcia. But that brings me to the point at hand. It was Judgment Day. It has been. It has come sooner than anticipated. Of course, it's supposed to be May 22nd. That's when the when the um when the when the when the B sample was supposed to be opened. But they said it was going to take a couple of days. Well, it only took one day. You know what I'm saying? They they had the results back. And, and Michael Ben said first first said it was reported. <laughs> It, 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 it reported me that uh, uh, Ryan Garcia's test results came back positive for the banned substance of Osterine, that PED, you know what I'm saying? And he said, reported me. <laughs> it's like you was still trying to reach out for a glimmer of hope. But then, you know, I did my research and did my due diligence. And Dan Raphael, who reported it, he said it definitively. He said that the test results came back reflecting the same thing as the A sample. So Ryan Garcia has cheated. Nigga, you was a bitch! So this is why I said it's sad. It's not sad because because I like Ryan Garcia. It's sad because, um, you know, now it just puts more questions on the sport, man. It's another bad spot. And I, lo I love the sport of boxing. And I, I really do. think Y'all know it's been documented if you pay attention to my channel. I was rooted for Ryan Garcia. What? I put money on Ryan Garcia. What? I won money off the Ryan Garcia win. What? I thought it was a phenomenal night for boxing. But guess what? Now my memory of that is, is, is bad. I still have the imagery in my head for Devin Haney getting brutalized like that and dominated. Oh, oh. Garcia. A left hook from the Oh, he dropped him! Oh! Oh, <laughs> oh bitch! Two big bombs come from Ryan Garcia. Another left hook from Ryan Garcia. Oh my god! Oh my gosh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Devin oh Haney go out like this, bro. This is tough, man. Oh my god! Oh my lord! But now it's for the wrong reasons because it was an even playing field. I don't care about the weight. That's in the realms and the confines of boxing. I don't care about the weight. But I do care about somebody taking banned substances because that's not the same thing. You know, having an advantage is not necessarily cheating. You know, I think having coming in at a higher weight is having an advantage and it shows a lack of discipline and a lack of professionalism, but it's not cheating. Having a banned substance is cheating. What? Having an illegal... PED is cheating. What? Having having uh, uh, um, uh, uh, something on your hand wraps to make your hand hit harder like margarito, that's cheating. What? So with this being said, um, I, I, want, I want all the people that are following all those channels that, that, are, that, are, that are coming up with these conspiracies to protect Ryan because they love Ryan or, or the people that were um, blaming Devin Haney saying it's his fault, like it was his fault that Ryan Garcia tested positive. Shut up, bitch. I, 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 I'm I'm a call for a call I'm a call for action, man. I'm gonna need y'all to question these people that when they when they come up with this information, you know. You just just come up with the truth. Whether you like Devin Haney or you like Ryan Garcia, you should want the sport to be clean. And and that's what I want, you know what I'm saying? So like I said, I'm not happy that Ryan Garcia cheated. I'm not happy that Devin Haney's getting his O back. I'm happy that the right thing was done. You know what I'm saying? If you're cheating, you should be reprimanded for it. You know, and it shouldn't take this long. You know what I'm saying? So uh, uh, I, I do think this is a step in the right direction, but it comes at the expense of my trust. You know, and I, and I have more questions as a, as a long observer and a pugilist enthusiast of boxing. You know, I, 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 I love it. And I think that Ryan Garcia, I thought the win would have been great for boxing because not because Devin Haney would have lost necessarily, but, you know, it would it would have made made um, others not worry about their oath so much. And then you got to come back and challenge other people to get your name, your reputation back and get back to the top of the pinnacle where you were. Once you suffer a loss, you got to prove yourself again, redeem yourself. But I think that this is the right thing that happened. Hopefully now we'll see if he gets a no contest. I think he should get a no contest. I think that L should be wiped away from his record. And, and, and I think Ryan Garcia should be banned. And I'm going to say a minimum of three years. Damn. I'm sorry. And I like Ryan Garcia, but I don't, I don't tolerate cheating, man, because people get hurt residually and, and chronically. You know what I'm saying? And that's the thing about this, too. You know, um, um, as a result of boxing, people can get hurt significantly and, and potentially even fatally and, and, and have lifelong residual chronic uh, and negative impacts from, from, from boxing, man. And I think that um, when, you, when you employ tactics that are illegal, 
you need to be reprimanded and we, and we, and we there's a, been a precedent there's a, been a precedent that has been set you know um, Amir Khan had, had was uh, caught with the same Osterine he got a minimum of two years so Ryan Garcia in my opinion his ban should be a, his suspension rather should be a minimum of two years I think you should hit harder I think the hammer should come down harder for people who do the same thing after the fact after seeing after after not learning your lesson so I think you should get a minimum of three years that's how I feel about it and I think that people who, who, who are watching these channels and, and, the, and these media they were calling about this conspiracy you know that's the thing about conspiracy right no matter even though these test results have come back positive people are still gonna say that it's a conspiracy right because that's the thing about conspiracies but when you say somebody's conspiring against you you can never really debunk or disprove or or approve a, a conspiracy right that's why people love them you know what i'm saying people love them because it's something that they can reach on and grab on so still 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 um look for the for the for the for the ryan garcia groupies to still reach on that there was a conspiracy still look for the Devin haney garcia uh, uh groupies to, to to want more than whatever happens you know what i'm saying no one's going to be satisfied but like i said this is a good it's a good thing for boxing but at the same thing it's a, at the same time it's simultaneously a bad thing for boxing because it's another stain and and and, and it, um it's good it, i don't know it just it just it just sucks man but hey i'm glad the right thing is done i think we're gonna we're gonna um we're gonna come back and report when that when the uh when the verdict has and the sentence has been passed, you know, and, and judgment has been bestowed on Ryan Garcia. But yeah, as, right, as of right now, he's a cheater. I don't rock with Ryan Garcia. I think he's trash. I'm going to be honest with you, man. Know your fucking place, trash. Y'all be easy. As far as far as a boxer goes, you know, as far as boxing and, and, and being and fair play goes. But y'all be easy. God bless y'all. Remember, with God, we can do anything without God. We're nothing. The doctor's out. Peace. From the hood to college, both worlds they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold, we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets.